Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Taryn and I love connecting with other moms, so I really hope that you'll subscribe to my channel. All you have to do is hit the red subscribe button right here down below. You can even hit the bell symbol and that will notify you anytime I post a brand new video. So today we are here in my disgusting pantry and I decided that it's time to give it a makeover because if y'all see this behind me, it's pretty bad and embarrassing. Normally every week, Monday mornings roll around and it is time for me to hit the grocery store for the week. I've got both kids with me, so by the time we get through the grocery store trip and get home and I'm unloading everything, I just shove it everywhere because they are screaming at me to get outside and go play. So usually that's what happens and then the week goes by and I just kind of forget about this mess behind me. So I decided that I am sick of it, I am done with this mess and recently I was on Pinterest and I saw pictures of perfectly organized pantry and where everything is like neatly in little bins and I just thought that is what I need because I just can't do this anymore. And our pantry is actually right towards the garage so if anyone enters our house through this way everyone sees this mess and it's embarrassing. So today we're going to do some major pantry organization motivation for you guys and maybe it will inspire you to do the same in your pantry. So I have already went out and purchased these bins that I found at Target. I have looked everywhere for these. I saw that some people were doing like the uh, Dollar Tree bins. Ours did not have those unfortunately, at least in the color that I wanted. So I got these at Target and I really like these. Um, they seem to be really well made and sturdy. I will link these down below in case you're interested in organizing your pantry too. Also, there's a few other bins that I've picked up recently um, to kind of get started on this project, and I know that I will be making a trip back to Target one or two more times probably to get either more of this size bin or maybe a few smaller ones to organize this mess. Okay, but first I'm going to give you guys an up close and personal look at how unorganized and gross this all is right now before I get started. Okay, you guys, so here is my mess of a pantry. Um, I don't really have much organized, like everything is literally just kind of thrown in here. I have all of my baking stuff, cooking stuff, some snacks mixed in for the kids, all the kids' snacks. There's a bunch of old cereal in there that I need to throw out. Um, so I know a lot of that will be going in the trash. Some of my snacks and protein bars and stuff here. Up here is a mess of breakfast stuff. Um, we have chips and bread that just get thrown up here all the time and fruit snacks, all of this stuff. I mean, just look at this. It is a disaster, you guys. All right, so now that you've seen just how bad it really is, I'm gonna get started. To get started, I threw away everything that was old or outdated and to be honest, it had been a while since I have done this. Next, I started figuring out what I would want in each bin, so I just categorized different items and started placing them in bins. And I knew I would need more bins, so the next morning I ran back to Target to get a few more and got started again. I was able to get all of this organizing done while the kids were napping, so that's why I spaced it out over three days.
I ended up needing a couple bins just in bigger sizes to wrap this up so I went back to Target one last time to get those before I could wrap up this project. And by the way, I know these bins are a little more expensive than ones that you might find at Dollar Tree or somewhere like that, but honestly, those were so flimsy that I feel like they probably would break very easily. And these from Target are so sturdy and I love them and I know that they'll last, so I think they're totally worth it. I'm loving the way that my pantry organization has turned out. Just in case you're curious about how I grouped everything, I put all of the kids' snacks up here out of reach because Camden loves to come and sneak them. All my baking goods are tucked away over here. Brian's koozie collection. And then I have all of my canned goods on this tray here. Here is kind of like a cooking bin. I've got pasta, breadcrumbs, and rice, things like that. Then over here I've got all of our cereal tucked away. Here is more like snacks and bars and things like that, crackers. Um, this bin is more of like crafts and Camden's learning stuff. Then we have all of our coloring books tucked away here. Up here I have all of like breakfast stuff and chia seeds, things like that. And then this is kind of like a chip bin, um, which I got some more chip clips that I need to put on those. And then here's the bread bin. So everything's neatly tucked away and then up here, I have um, markers, crayons, Play-Doh, paints, anything that I don't want Camden to get a hold of. And then also this is like a treat bin um, to keep high out of reach for him too. And, then, and I've got electronics stored on the top, that way Camden cannot reach any of those either. Paper towels, Kleenex, and I'll show you guys my laundry kind of side of the room in a second too. But oh, this feels so much better having this all nice and clean. But that wraps up the tour of the finished pantry. All right, so because our pantry is connected with our laundry room, I thought I would give you guys a tour of that because I went ahead and cleaned that up too. So I organized in bins up here all of our laundry detergents and things like that. And then that's just kind of an extra bin to keep random things tucked away in a bowl here as well. Gotta represent Texas. All of these signs I found at Home Goods. These baskets are all from Home Goods. Um, and then I found this rock at Home Goods too. It holds all of our sunglasses and then Brian's work stuff. Um, that's where we put our keys and things like that that we need on a daily basis. But I think it turned out really good. I'm really happy with um, the way it looks. And then just to give you guys a full tour of our pantry slash laundry room, um, I got this really cute hat and coat rack at Target. Um, I can link that below too if I find that. So that's where we keep all that stuff. And then here's where I hang my bags on the back of the door right there. And then over here is where we have like a message board and calendar and things like that. And then a stool for us to put on our shoes before we head out the door. But that is our whole laundry room and pantry. All right, well that wraps up my tour of my finished organized pantry and I really hope that this video will provide some motivation for you to do some extreme organization in your home as well. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Also be sure to subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you in my next video. Thank you so much for watching, bye.